Hello guys, welcome back to the topic on uh, deploying a Python script in AWS EC2 instance. So in the previous video, we saw how to create a new EC2 instance and uh, we have downloaded our PEM file to our local drive. Okay. In this video, let us see how to connect to your EC2 instance using the PuTTY. If you do not have PuTTY in your PC, just go to this link and download the latest version of PuTTY. So here I have PuTTY already installed. So I'm just skipping that part because it is an easy process and you can install it without any complexity. Okay. So once you install PuTTY, you will be able to see PuTTY and PuTTY Gen. As a first step, in order to convert your .pem file into a private key, we need this PuTTY Gen. Just remember, I told in the previous video like, we need to remember the location where we download the PEM file. So let us go to that particular location and load our PEM file. Okay. So this is searching for .ppk, but we have .pem file. So you can just change the filter to all files and you will be able to see the .pem file. Click on open. So this says like successfully imported the foreign key and just give okay. And make sure you have selected RSA and click on save private key. Just click on S. So here I'm just saving it as a PK file. It is a private key file. Just click on save. Okay. Close the window. Now go to PuTTY. As I told earlier, you wanted to connect to your instance using its public DNS. So just copy this public DNS and paste it here in the host name. Make sure that the port is pointing to 22 and the connection type is SSH. Okay. In under the data, you can just give your auto login username as EC2 user. Okay. And just expand SSH. There you will find auth in the credentials just browse the pk file which you have just created using the putty gen okay and go back to the session and give a name to it like um, python ec2 and click on save so the reason why we are saving it is in the when you when you wanted to connect to this instant the next step just click on this and click open okay just give accept here okay if you see here we have successfully connected to our ec2 instance using putty okay in the next video we will try to uh, understand what are the different versions of python which is already available in ec2 if we uh, also we will try to in install the version which we required for our application and create a simple python script and try to execute in the ac2 instance okay thanks for watching this video have a nice day